Massachusetts is a leader in healthcare and has the highest rate of people insured of any state in the country. When we do surveys, we see only 3% of people in Massachusetts don't have insurance coverage. But when you ask people about the past year, if they had insurance coverage or not, the number is much higher, it's 7%, almost half a million people in Massachusetts. One of the big barriers to health insurance in Massachusetts is cost. A few years ago, I worked for an employer who did not offer health insurance. I think it was $365 a month on top of paying $3,500 in deductibles before my health insurance would even kick in. It just didn't make sense for what I was making. You don't want to go to the hospital. You don't want to get nailed with a crazy bill that will take you probably 10 years to pay off. The healthcare system in Massachusetts is incredibly complicated. It's really hard to know what you're eligible for for insurance coverage and how to get it. Moi, j'ai fait 11 mois et même plus sans assurance. Et moi, même moi, j'ai pensé me dégainer parce que moi, j'ai fait deux fois ça va te marcher. Moi, j'ai eu un problème à l'hôpital. Les mauvais ont été embarqués en assurance. Puis gros problème, moi, j'ai confronté avec Assurance médicale là, c'est des problèmes de langage. There are tremendous issues of inequities in healthcare coverage as well. People who are black or Hispanic are twice as likely to not have health insurance in Massachusetts as people who are either white or Asian. If you're an immigrant in Massachusetts, it's even more complicated. Soy de República Dominicana. Vine a este país y durante un tiempo, año y medio específicamente, estuve indocumentada y sin seguro médico. Me encuentro con un país muy diferente al mío, todo el idioma, la moneda, el desenvolvimiento. Tenía molestias en mis rodillas, también mucho dolor en mi estómago. Por el hecho de no tener el seguro, pues me cohibía de ir a un centro de salud porque sabía que sería muy costoso. A 3% uninsured rate in Massachusetts. We may not think that's that big of a number, but we have to remember, those are our neighbors, those are our friends, those are our family members. I lost my health insurance in my early 50s due to the fact that I was laid off. Who wants to go through life without health insurance just because you just can't afford it? There's more work to be done. The report that the Blue Cross Blue Shield of Massachusetts Foundation just published gives you strong, solid data on the remaining uninsured and gives recommendations to the state about what they can do to get more people covered.